Alpha's updated status. Gonna call them in a minute. <laughs> it's just wonderful. There we go. Oh, good. A safe spot. Let's see what's over here. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, laughing my ass off. <laughs> whoa, 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 I didn't want to do that. Or did I? Or did I? Sunderplane gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything. Let's see, what do I do with Sunderplane? Check approach. I think I have to approach Sunderplane. You get close to Sunderplane, but not too close. Eh? Human? I have to like... I know I have to touch these greens. There we go. Sunderplane looks over, then turns up its nose. Get closer. You get close to Sunderplane. Again. Oh, he's like bashful or something. There we go. I think I can spare him now. Sunderplane accidentally bumps you with its wing. There we go. Noise. Let's see. Can't go up there quite yet. Alrighty. Uh, what's... I don't, is anything down here? I'm gonna check real quick. What is this? Oh, there's a frying pan over there. I have a feeling that's gonna be armor, but I can check it out anyway. I mean, uh, not armor, a weapon. There's a fry pan lying on the ground. Will you take it? You got the burnt pan. Let me check that out, see what it does. Burnt pan, weapon, uh, 10. The damage is rather consistent. Consumable items heal. Four more HP. Alright, cool. What's down here? Actually, you want to see what's down here. What's down here? Oh, this just puts me back up. Alright, cool. Alright. Let us continue on. <laughs> OMG. I've had my claw over the last digit for five minutes. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Ring, ring. Click. Whoever was calling hung up before you answered it. Ring. Uh, uh, hi. So, the blue lasers, uh, I mean, Elf is here. Hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. Uh, orange ones, um, you have to be moving. And they, um, they won't move through those ones. Uh, bye. Click. So if I move through them... <laughs> OMG, I did it! Claws haven't shook like that since Undyne called me to ask about the weather. So I can move through this one. Whoa! Wait, there's no weather down here. Why did she call me? Did I... Oh shit, really? I must have... Accidentally... Did a thing. Uh... There we go. Must have accidentally uh, stopped in the middle of that orange one. The lasers were deactivated. Right. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go! Alphys posted a picture. Cute pic of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. Ring. Uh, Al Alphys here. The... The northern door will stay locked until you s solve the puzzles on the right and left. I, I, I think you should go to the right first. Yeah. And in good fashion, I accidentally go the wrong way. No, 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 no. Sorry, I'm just having a good time. Whee! Wait, this is the left. <laughs> Directionally challenged? Yes. This is the right. Oh, there's cool people down here. The way to work is blocked, so I had time to catch Metaton's show on my phone. The special effects were amazing today. That human almost looked real. <laughs> he looked like you! Metaton, he's the most popular star in the underground. His fan club probably has at least two, no three dozen members. Wonder if it would be unfun if I explained the puzzle. There's like instructions over here. Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. Hey, cool cat. 
The door leading through this area is closed, so I tried the puzzle, but I kept running out of ammo and it kept restarting? Questions? And my two co-workers won't help? It's like they don't even want to go to work? Maybe I can do it. Boom! What do you got to say about that, Hepcat? Wow, you solved it? I'm impressed, I think. You must be be a total nerd. You must have not taken a grammar class. Alright, let's go to the other one. I think the other one's a little harder, which is why they told us to go to the uh, to the right first. Alphys here. That blue laser seems totally impassable, but as the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the Hotland laser database and take it out. Click. Here's some more cool people. <laughs> we were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules. They've got to cancel Skull over this. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now that we're free, we can... Well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. Uh, your head is on fire like Hades. And so this is another one of those puzzles. Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes. Uh, let's see, I get I get two this time. Uh, there we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right. So now we can go up. Through here. Yes. Yes. Alpha's updated status. Whatever. I'll just explain it. Ring. <laughs> uh, I think, um... Hey. About the puzzles on the left and right. They're a bit difficult to explain, but... Uh, you already solved them? Awesome! Click. Yes. I am the smartest. Wee. Uh-oh. Uh, hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry. I I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Ah, whoa, whoa. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hello! Oh, yes. Uh, welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premiere cooking show! Cooking with a killer robot. Da, 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 da. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake! My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone give them a big hand! Oh, yay me. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. No. What happens if I just try to leave? Oh, I can't. MTT brand microwave. Origin of the MTT challenge. Put your food in and set the microwave on high for five minutes. If you can still recognize your meal, we'll double your money back. <laughs> you found the eggs. You found the milk. You found the sugar. Perfect! Great job, beautiful! We've got all of the ingredients we need to bake the cake! Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my! What a magnificent moment! How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient! Ah! A human soul! <laughs> Hi, Psycho! What is that? Ring. Hello, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Oh, wait a second! Couldn't you just make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan? Uh, well, I mean, that's a brilliant idea, Alphys. Actually, I happen to have an option right here. MTT brand, always convenient human soul flavored substitute. A can of which is just over there on that counter. 
that really uh, inconspicuous looking counter. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? All right, I'll just, uh, just go over here and get them. No problem. Oh, it's a rocket ship. Well, rocket propelled, abnormally high shelf. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So better start climbing, beautiful. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. <sighs> Fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says jetpack? Watch this. This is impossible. Why does my phone not do this? I demand a refund on my phone. There. You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there. All right, here I go. Here I go. You actually have to dodge things like food items while doing this. So it's kind of another bullet hell type of a game. I will do the best I can. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, how? How did I dodge that? Okay, I guess I wasn't gonna get that lucky. Mm, peanuts. Ah! Oh, so many marshmallow fluffies! Why do you hate me, marshmallow fluffies? Why? Alright, here we go. Almost there, I think. Peanuts! Ah! If I collect all these things, I could make s'mores. Ah, what? That's okay, I think I got there anyway. Yes, slow-mo action. My, my. It seems you've bested me. But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I loathe to think what would have happened to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. Oh, really? <laughs> wow, we we did it. We really did it. Great job out there, team. Well, uh, anyway, let's keep moving forward. All right, let's do it. Whew, safe spot. An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Alrighty, before we do anything else, I forgot to do something. I wanted to try a few things. First of all, that I had received in the comments, suggestions I had received in the comments about getting the Temi armor. And also, in the excitement of doing this Let's Play, I forgot to go back to Undyne's place so we could hang out with her and Papyrus, and I really want to do that. I almost forgot. It is some- I've, I've done it before, but it's sometimes really hard to stay on track when you're recording a Let's Play or trying to do voices and the commentary and your bird is squawking in the next room and you're all kinds of preoccupied. See that building in the distance? That's the core, the source of all power for the underground. It converts geo geothermal energy into magical electricity by... Uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. In the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. Click. So yeah, I'm not going to continue this. I was actually scared that I would not be able to go back to Snowden or to the ghost town, but I can go back. So I can go back by going to this elevator. Which I'm just gonna do this right now, you guys. I am not fucking around. <laughs> I want to uh, do this stuff and get it done. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and save my game right here. This is a precaution. I actually made a backup file just in case I fuck all of this up. And what I'm gonna do is go here and I'm going to take the ferryman ride. Tra la la. I'm the river man, or am I the river woman? It really doesn't matter. I love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Never thought I'd be on a boat. We're going to go to Waterfall, because Waterfall is where you can get the uh, Tem armor, uh, as far as I'm aware. Somebody had offered me a great suggestion about getting the Tem armor with kind of a money exploit, so I'm gonna be trying that out. Hum, 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 hum. 
I'm having a little concert. In my head? I'm crazy! I just imagine the ferryman or fairy woman is uh, completely bonkers. Come again sometime. Tra la la. Ooh, you'll touch my tra la la. Okay. Uh, let's start with the money exploit. Uh, so, what I've been told is that you can buy the uh, cloudy glasses and sell them to Temi, and you can keep selling them, I guess, and it's kind of like a little money exploit. Then you can get enough money to, uh, I guess, to uh, get the Tem armor. So I guess the first thing I'm going to do, whoops, is spend all my money. Uh, the first thing I'm going to do is actually, I've got that uh, cell phone now, so I can use that to store a lot of my stuff. So I'm going to put um, a lot of stuff in here. And then I'll have enough room to buy all of these, uh, cloudy glasses. I'm just gonna buy all of them. And hopefully I'll get, uh, enough money. Maybe. Hopefully this works. <laughs> okay, so I've bought, I've bought all the cloudy glasses. I'm gonna exit from here. And just see if I can somehow somehow do this with the Tem armor. Get the Tem armor. Oi! <laughs> Welcome to the Tem shop. We're going to sell Claude glasses. <laughs> Whoa! You got a Claude glasses. And I gotta have the Claude glasses, but I gotta pay for college. And Tem always wanna Claude glasses. I want to say no because I think I can get more. But, but, uh. okay. Ten by cloud glasses for sixty-five. I'll say yes. And let's say, oh my god, is she so happy? And then she'll buy them for fifty. So I'm just gonna keep selling them to her. Oh my. Okay, so. We've almost got enough money. I'm gonna do that a couple more times until I reach the $1,000 to uh, get the Tem armor. So as soon as I do that and get the Tem armor, we will be back via editing magic. Okay, so I am back. It occurred to me that I could go ahead and use my uh, my cell phone box, the dimensional boxes. I didn't have to just, you know, keep on putting the clawed glasses in there. So I bought a bunch of clawed glasses Put some of them in my box, sold some of them, and now I'm going to keep selling them to her until... What the heck? Wow, so, okay, yes, I, I understand, Tem. So now, I have more than enough money because I profited. Basically, I profited because I got 20 more pieces of gold than I would normally have uh, from the cloudy glasses. She paid sometimes 65 uh, but if I kept repeating myself, she would pay 50, so made a profit, got enough gold here, so I'm gonna exit. No, I'm not gonna exit it. Boy! I go to Colleague, and then I'm going to go ahead and pay for Colleague. <laughs> Whoa! That's a lot of months. Can Tem really accept? Okay, so Tem go to Colleague and pay and make you prouds. It, oh, you! Oh, your face, Tem. Tem, that's okay. Uh, she's back. She noticed. It's okay. <laughs> Tem back from Cool Egg. Tem learned many things. Learned to sell new item. Yeah. Okay, so now we should have actually access to the Temmy armor, which is eight thousand gold. I was under the impression that we would get it for free because I paid for college. Apparently, that's not how it works. <laughs> Damn it. All right, then. Um, all right, then. Okay, we're going to try something else. I'll be right back. 
Alrighty, I am back. I decided to go ahead and do the money exploit to get the Tem armor. It did take a little while as a couple people did warn me it might take a while to get the money. And I hear that if you die a couple times as well, you can get a discount on the armor. I didn't do that. I just kind of turned off the recording for a while, while relaxed and got all the money I needed for the Tem armor. I've never used it before. I heard it's pretty good. It's the best armor in the game. Not a whole much of a big deal here, so I'm going to go ahead and buy with my 8,000 gold, holy crap, uh, my 20 defense, Tem armor. Not sure if it was worth it or not, but for the sake of this let's play, now you know how to get it. Now you know about the money exploit with the Tem armor, and you can choose to do it if you, if you want to. So we're gonna go ahead, buy it. Thanks, purchase! And we've got the Tem armor. And I am going to go ahead and uh, put on that Tem armor right now. <laughs> because I don't want to forget. So here's uh, the Temi armor. We're going to go ahead and don the Temi armor. And before moving on, uh, the next thing we're going to do is actually go to Undyne. That's what I said I would be doing in this next few parts of the Let's Play. Because I don't want to forget... There was a time where I did forget and I was so regretful. The part with Undyne and, and hanging out with her and Papyrus is so fun. I can't wait to do that one. But before I do that, ooh, got something caught in my throat. Before I do that, I'm gonna stop at this turtle dude's shop and pick up some more stuff. Uh, I don't have that much money left, but that's okay. I'm gonna go for a crab apple. And another crab apple. Let's just buy a bunch of crab apples. There we go. Now I feel good. So we can exit that. So now we're gonna go back to uh, Undyne's house, which is, I believe it's over here somewhere. I'm gonna go ahead and save my game right here before we do the Undyne stuff. And we'll save right here. Oh, the human arrives. Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? I have a plan to make you two great friends. <laughs> Will you hang out? No, no, yes. Okay, stand behind me. <laughs> Psst. Make sure to give her this. What? A, a biscuit? She loves these. 